Hey, it's Maureen McCann with Promotion Career Solutions, and I'm on today talking to you about the importance of your career values. Hey, so this is something that doesn't come up very often um, on a day-to-day -day basis anyway, but when you're taking a look at what types of work you want to do next, it's more than just salary and promotion and the prestigious companies that you might want to be applying to. You want to take an introspective look. You want to think back on positive work experiences and negative work experiences. When you think about the negative experiences, jot those down as well, because what we're going to do is we're going to flip them. So if you found that it was a very negative experience to have too much autonomy, then when you work at your next job, you're going to want someone who is a really hands-on type leader and can really help you navigate the next step in your career. Um, but that's just one example. There's all kinds of different examples of things that are important uh, when you're making a career transition. So you really want to take a look at your own personal values. These are things like honesty, integrity, trust. But above and beyond those types of things, there's some other stuff that you should be thinking about when you make a move from one job to the next. Things like, you know, who are the colleagues that I'm going to be working with? Who's the client? What type of leadership is there? What's the culture like? How far is the commute from where I live? What is, what is that like? Uh, is there some time flexibility in terms of when you show up at work and when you need to leave? Um, you know, so there's all kinds of things that you can consider when you're looking to make a move from, from one job to the next. But it's really important that you first start with introspection. What's most important to me? What you're doing there is you're creating a finish line for your job search. I know I will have been successful if these are the things that are included in my next role. Um, anyway, I hope that's been helpful tips and recommendations for you. I see it all the time in my practice, so I thought I'd just take a moment and share it with you folks here. Um, if you have any questions about that, uh, please let me know in the comment section below, and I'll look forward to seeing you again online soon.